this. Let's see this. Alright. I'm going to take this over. Now, um, I like for my relief sculpture to um, stand off the wall because of the shadow effect that that creates. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a ridge in the back that's going to hold it off the surface of the piece that I'm going to mount it to. Um, and so I had planned this size piece when this lines up with the larger piece that's getting ready to come out of the kill and they will line up and I will drill and put some welding wire into uh, those pieces and uh, use JB Weld which is a little magic uh, epoxy and so what that does uh, is it holds it together and it's not going to come loose. We'll get some extra pieces and we'll take fettling knife again. All right. So I'm going to cut for my back pieces. Now because I have a cavity here and I want to make this, these forms con conform to that, um, this is a device that's used uh, in carpentry. And so I'll line this up, push this down, and then I can cut, cut my piece. And I, this, this clay I cut at, a, at a, a half an inch so that it's going to be a little thicker and it's going to allow for the drilling into uh, part of the process check this. Okay, so that's going to pretty much fit down in there. Alright, I'm going to score this surface. I'm going to score this surface. Score this one. I'll come back and do another flange, if you would. And then uh, I'm going to use vinegar. Vinegar is an acid and what that does is it causes the clay to break down a little bit. Some people use slip. Um, I started using this. David Camden showed me this trick. And so, uh, thanks David. Uh, anyway, um, this works great because this is going to cause the clay to break down, soften a little bit. And then I can come back. And here's my wood tool. So now I'm going to join my surfaces. I'm going to take another little piece of clay, make a coil, press that. This is the welding part of it. Okay. And do another one on this side. Join it. Okay, then I'm going to do this side up under the edge. another coil, press this in, join it really well. I try to keep the clay similar thickness, about the thickness, you know, the most I want to get the thickness of, say, my thumb. I'm going to put the smaller ones in here. I'm going to take my wire 
and I'm going to pull across both sides. Okay, I went too far with that one. That uh, did not do what I wanted to do. But I'm going to try to go with it. <laughs> it's what we did. <laughs> 